hi there so in this video I'm going to show you how to use tables in Corel draw so first thing create one blank document in Corel draw so I have created this document with default settings and setting the size for the document to a4 now click on ok and you have your blank document I'm going to zoom it a bit so that I can have more clear view now on left hand toolbar you will find this table tool that you can use so select that and just drop a table on your document as you can see it is total three rows and four columns you can change these properties on top standard property bar simply change this to let's say four by four and you have something like this now here you can change the background to let's say this purple or you can go with green or you can go for something like this blue okay you can also change the individual cell color if you want in order to do that simply go to windows then dockers and then object manager in my case object manager is right here and on page one you can see we have table and its respective cells that you can edit now you can select cell one one and you have this color simply change that to purple and you can do that if you use right click you can also change the border to white okay or you can simply select entire table and then choose the borders set it to all then change its pixel to let's say 8 and then you can change its color to white okay so for that simply go ahead select it and use right hand side white for that now inside cell you'll find still the black border which can be changed by individually selecting that cell and then right clicking on the color to make it white okay so simply select this then go here right click keep right clicking and you'll have this border color changed now as you can see you can also change the cell spacing with this property okay now here you see nudge distance and then you have duplicate distance okay and if you select this you will find that you get options for your table separated cell borders okay so here you find those options set it to 2 and see what happens Okay. as you can see your table is completely changed from what it was earlier now it has more 3d like appearance now and inside this you can add your text okay you can also insert image from any other graphic that you have imported into document and you can also use it as let's say for adding multiple text and image within same cell so as you can see these are some of the things that you can do and you can use tables for document layout you can use it for creating some of the PDF pages using these tables where you can use it for any graphic specific element or you can use it simply for even text data that you usually do with word or excel okay so this was a short video on how to use tables and what you can do with it